Hey guys, Sarah Kasim here again. Today I will be showing you how to use the staff account. But before I go on, guys, I would like you to know that we have a directory of videos teaching you how to maximize your bumper app and all its amazing features. So the first thing is you're going to come to your bumper home page. This is how the home page looks like. Next thing after coming to your home page is you would be clicking on more. So to find more, more as you can see is on the bottom right corner just right here. So you can see just right here you would find the more option after clicking on more you go on staff accounts click on staff account the next thing you can see invite staff or the plus sign to invite your staff you can write the staff designation title full name of the staff here and after doing that you click on the email address that's the staff email address after um, the, adding the email address you can also add your phone number remember to add the correct email address and the correct phone number if not you'll be getting an error message like this so i will just be trying any email this email does not belong to me but for the sake of this session i will be using and also be using an imaginary phone number to for the sake of this session after doing that you can come on this permission whatever permission you like to give your staff product orders you want them to view do you want them to manage whatever it is if you like them to view then you click or toggle or the view if you want them to manage also do the same next thing we'll do is click on continue after clicking on continue you can see all the details click on the hide permission so that it shows you everything next you click on everything and if everything is done and you are satisfied you then click on invite staff so you can see the invite staff option just below here after doing that invitation will be sent you can add more staff you have access to add three staff in your staff account you have access and when you're done just come right here and check you can also remove it when you are done or when this person no longer works for you or this person doesn't interact with your business anymore so you can come here click on remove and then if you see here you can click on check view login activity every activity that this person has taken you can find it if this person no longer works for you you can go on to remove this stuff from your business it's very easy it's very fast and you can do it in the blink of an eye <laughs> thank you again for joining us today myself today on the staff account feature do not forget to go to our bomba lane directory for more videos on how to efficiently use your bomba store till i see you again have a fantastic day and don't forget to give up a thumbs up <laughs>